Well guys, it's been a couple of months since I've posted, so figured I owed you an explanation of what I've been working on. So these are the 823 heads, 823 heads off the L96, and for the last three months I've been uh, spending hours on the weekends and evenings hoarding these up. They're not perfect by any means, but uh, compared to what they were like before, I think they're a, a substantial improvement. Basically started with a double cut steel burr and uh, just looked at uh, taking off the rough surface. And if you look at the intake through here, this is what the interior of the port used to be like, this sort of sand cast finished. Uh, and so taken that down to the point where it's pretty darn smooth these valve guides were also quite large so I've taken those down pulled them out to a point show the exhaust these are exhaust ports now and again not perfect but you get a substantial step up from where they were before. And then the intakes. There was a whole heap of flashing on the sides here on either edge which I've pulled out. So there's no flashing left anymore. There was also large bump here on the left which is largely gone down there at the bottom I left the uh, I think that's the stud uh, bump in didn't want to have to fill that with epoxy and then there's still a bump here for the spring perch which I left in as well but I took both of those down pretty substantially from where they were before try to keep each port as even as possible. So, just gone through and giving them a final bath before I uh, before I install the springs, upgraded springs. There's also a section through here where, on the uh, head, you can see they ground ground them out slightly maybe to get the uh, the seat in but maybe to open up a little bit of flow so I just took them down slightly it didn't take a lot out of the combustion chamber at all and just rounded off this edge here for the for the spark plug so tried not to take too much out all I really wanted to do was just sort of smooth it and maybe give it a slightly better path for the air to flow around the valve as you can see the valve guys have cleaned up gotta be really careful and as much as possible I blended the blended the seat but keep away from the from the angles themselves you don't want to cut into those so overall really pleased with how they turned out and uh, should be bolting these back on the truck pretty soon hope everyone's going well